I, I do think it makes a big impact in terms of developing a team atmosphere. Um, this is a team, we have the same goal. Uh, you want to do well in this class, I want you to do well in this class. And, and I think providing those tips is a very concrete way of showing students that we, we really do care about how you learn this material. Um, I actually had a student this semester um, come up to me after the first day of class and her comment was, thank you for caring about how we do. Um, the study tips last semester in 12-11 really, really helped. I really learned a lot from them and, and I really appreciate that you all stopped to think about that. Um, so it was just one student, but I'll take that. And we have a study tip for every class day of the semester. Um, we try to time them so that they're, they're relevant to what's going on. So as we get close to the first exam, we try to make it about how to study for an exam. As we get close to final exams, we start talking about scheduling and planning and making study plans and things like that. Um, as we get to the point in the semester that people start sort of losing their energy and, and things like that, we try to start talking about reviewing and, and different things that, that we can do. So the idea was really just to make it a sustained notion that you should work on your study skills all semester and we're going to support you in doing that. In my large classes, I think it's difficult for students both the ones that are doing really well in class and the ones that are not doing well in class to feel a connection with the professor. So after every exam I send not a mass email but an individual specifically hi John <laughs> email um, to all the students that get below a certain grade on the exam um, reminding them of my office hours, our grade improvement plan, encouraging them to get back on track as soon as they can. But I also send one to everybody who gets an A on the exam. And so it's an individual, it's a very short email just literally noticed, you know, wanted to send you a quick email to congratulate you on your grade exam, grade, keep up the hard work. Um, I get more response to the emails to the students that get an A than I do to the students who are doing poorly, though I do get a good response to those. Um, but the fact that somebody took the time to send an individual email to a student to tell them good job uh, really means a lot to a lot of our students, especially the freshmen who come in and are taking three or four really large lecture courses. Um, and again, I think it goes back to that idea that somebody's paying attention, somebody cares, and we're kind of on the same team.